hey 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 welcome back to my channel so as you can see from the title today i'm bringing to you the shallow fried chicken breast with some creamy mushroom sauce i must tell you you cannot resist this and this is very fast and easy to make this is going to definitely impress your visitors without much talking let's just get started i'll get a bowl and break in two eggs I'll come in with a pinch of my favorite seasoning, some dark soy sauce, some white pepper, and I'll grate in some nutmeg. Using a fork, I'll just whip it up. I'll set it aside for later. Now I'll get some white flour. I'll come in with some black pepper, a little bit of seasoning, and some salt to taste. I'll mix everything up and set it aside for later. I'll get some breadcrumbs also, coming with some seasoning to taste. I'll mix everything up and set it aside for later. Here I've got my chicken breast, I'll just slice it into smaller pieces. I'll put it in a bowl and come in with some garlic. I'll drop in my seasoning and come in with some dark soy sauce. I'll put in some oregon, then mix everything up to distribute it evenly. I'll put a pan on fire and come in with some oil. So I'll get my chicken breast and dip it in the egg mixture. Next, I will transfer it into the flour mixture. Then finally, I will put it into the breadcrumbs mixture. Afterwards, I will put it in a different plate for later. Now, the oil is hot enough, so I will come in with my coated chicken breast. So basically, I'll be frying it for about 2 minutes on each side. Don't forget we're doing this on medium fire. So after frying the chicken breast, this is what I have here. I'll just set it aside. Now it's time for the white mushroom sauce. I'm going to use the oil from the fried chicken because I need that flavor in my sauce. Afterwards, I will come in with some garlic. I'll fry the garlic for a minute. Next, I will come in with my chopped onions. This will be fried on low fire for about 4 minutes. Then, I will come in with my mushroom. I will fry this till the mushroom is well cooked. After the mushroom has been well cooked, I will come in with about half a tablespoon of flour. This will help thicken up the sauce. Next, I will come in with some chicken broth. I will let it cook for about two to three minutes. Then I will come in with some thick sour cream. I'll drop in some black pepper and I'll let this cook for about 3 to 4 minutes. Finally, when it's ready, I'll put off the fire and come in with my chopped spring onions. So, our white sauce is ready. Now I must apologize, I did lose the part when I was serving. I know it's satisfying to watch, but I'm sorry. I basically covered the chicken with the mushroom sauce. 
and this is what we have here and guys i wish you could taste this but unfortunately you cannot taste and smell this through the internet all what you can do is to give it a try yourself and if you do let me know how it comes out for you if you've not subscribed please don't forget to hit the subscribe button don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me a big fat thumbs up until next time i'm gonna see you again with another nice and interesting one bye bye